Hey, what is up you guys? Welcome to or welcome back to my channel. My name is Josh and I have a brand new video for you guys today. I'm back. <laughs> I took a break cause my brain needed a break from YouTube, but I'm ready to come back a million thousand percent if that even makes sense. So who's ready? <laughs> so I have a brand new video for you guys today. Like always, we're going to get back to the old schedule. So you guys already know I upload Monday. Wednesdays and Fridays but today we're going to be doing a full face of dragon beauty so if you guys want to see what I think of the brand and its products make sure to keep on watching <laughs> like this video make sure you leave a comment down below and make sure you guys hit that thumbs up button for that youtube algorithm and don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you aren't subscribed to my channel already how are you here not subscribed to my channel yet and make sure you guys hit that post notification icon so you're notified every single time i drop a brand new video just like this one but yeah let's let's see what miss nikita got for us today you already know all right so if you guys did not see, I did a video a month ago or like two months ago. I'll put it right here, wherever the hell that little eye is. I did reacting uh, to Nikita Dragon, you know, the reaction videos that you guys like. And, you know, Miss Nikita saw it and she dropped this egg off at my house. No, I'm joking. Imagine. <laughs> she did not drop this egg off at my house. I wish she did, however. I ordered this on Dragon Beauty. I ordered the egg, which includes... Dragon Beauty's Dragon Heart Transformation Powder. Bam! <laughs> and it also includes the Dragon Beauty Dragon Fire Color Corrector. Corrector. Corrector de color. I should speak of French. I don't even know what that means. I like how this egg looks on my table. It looks so cute. It came out of her own beep. No, let me stop. <laughs> And I also picked up the face press powder palette, I believe it's called. And as well as the brand new released Dragonfire Collector Corrector in Lavendor. <laughs> so let's jump right into it. Obviously, it's not everything like eyeshadow, boom, bam, that. But we'll just go with the natural look and just see how each of the products work. But yeah, let's get right into it. So like I said... Like every product on this channel, we have to give it a chance. So, of course, we are going to go in with the Bobbi Brown Vitamin Enrich Face Base as a primer. Yes, I look at the bottle every time I read it because I still don't know how to pronounce it. <laughs> We're going to prime my face... Earthquake. <laughs> We're going to prime my face with this bad boy to make sure we give all these products, you know, that A1 chance. Okay, so I've applied them as Bobbi Brown Cosmetics on my cara. So now we are going to go in. So I'm not a Dragon Beauty scientist, nor do I work for the Compania, but I think Nikita goes in with the orange and like blends it in with the concealer, obviously to block out the blue or black hairs that would grow on a guy because she's transgender. I still don't think she even has a five o'clock shadow, but whatever, it doesn't matter. So it's more for like transgender and stuff like that or just men in makeup in general who want to hide their five o'clock shadow like aka me but i see her going with the orange boom 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 and then i see her do the lavender which i think is for brightening yellow tones so like you know like under here you know maybe if you want to brighten here but who knows let's go in with it so we're gonna go in with this dragon foyer Ooh, look at that oh i like the I like the feeling that it has on the top of the component. It feels really, really nice. It's like dragon scales. <laughs> dragon tails. <laughs> All right, let me stop. But word, let's uh, bounce into this baby. So I'm just gonna put it like, I guess on my, let's do on my mustache area. <gasps> Whoa, I did a lot. <laughs> All right, let's see how it blends out first. Cause I don't even, I don't even be knowing. Okay, you could tell that it kind of blocked out the blue though. Like it like neutralized me. I'm impressed. Let's keep going because I got more. <laughs>
All right, so from what I could tell, it's kind of blocked out most of my facial hair, like an orange would, because, you know, color wheel stuff. However, it does dry out really quickly, so don't do what I did. Don't, like, place it everywhere you want to blend it and then blend it, because that, that's not his job. That's not its mission. That's not his statement. It's more like, um, you know, put blend, put blend. <laughs> she dries fast. So, show. Now, let's put this thing away. Oh my god, I got orange on her. I'm sorry, Miss Thing. Okay, let's put her down. By the way, get your DK merch at dkmerch.com. Well, DK. <laughs> this guy hasn't came out yet. This will be coming out in a few weeks. But you guys can go pick up every other thing. I'll put the link in the description down below. Use code Josh for 20% off. That's wrong. Use code Josh for 10% off. <laughs> All right, next we are going to go in with the next Dragon Beauty collector co color corrector And this is the lavender one. This is supposedly for brightening as they state So I guess we're just gonna go on under eye because that's really the areas I want more brightened I guess you can say um, I'm like looking for my mirror like an idiot Let's hit it I don't know if that's a lot. I don't know if that's too much. <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> we'll learn. I don't think that's too much. I think that's a good amount. And I'm not gonna lie, it already is looking pretty bright. I do like how that's looking so far. So I guess now that we've done that, Let's do the base like I normally would and you know all that stuff. I'm going to go in with the Bobbi Brown Skin Long Wear Weightless Foundation in the shade Golden Honey as usual. So how are you guys? What's been going on in your guys' life? I was busy with um, the launch and stuff of DK, you know, photo shoots and whatnot. <laughs> Various days and so. For my uh, viewers who listen to the podcast, we were still doing the podcast. So, if you guys are a real fan, I know you guys didn't miss me too much because I was still doing that because <laughs> I didn't have to be on camera. But I was just like, you know redoing stuff at home like i have a brand new desk for my makeup and stuff like that so it's a lot easier now because i had so much stuff my desk was becoming a mess now it's a lot more organized now i can actually get stuff done <laughs> i would get in new packages and my mess would my desk would be a mess already because i would have like four packages for the upcoming videos while my desk already couldn't fit what it had on it and I was just like where am I gonna put this stuff and somehow I would always find somewhere to put it <laughs> got a haircut cut my hair the shortest has been in a while but we bullying now all right so I did the foundation usually as usual two pumps gets me done now we are going to go in with the Ilmaki uh fuck I'm flawless concealer you know one of my favorites you guys already know We are going to blend that out. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, it looks really good. <laughs> like, I'm like really brightened. Like, uh, okay. The concealer in the name, like, fuck, I'm flawless, but, like, with this, like, under eye brightening lavender, I think it's even more flawless. Fuck, I'm double flawless concealer. <laughs> fuck, I'm flawless, flawless concealer. Or fuck, fuck, I'm flawless concealer. Or fuck, I'm flawless concealer concealer. 
Who knows? But that looks immaculate. Are you guys seeing that? Wow. Wow. <laughs> All right. Who knows? Who, who knew? Who knew Nikita did? So, so far, I'm liking it, you know? Uh, I thought it was a little orange for my bearded area, but it did get covered up pretty good. I don't see too much orange coming through. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys think. I look a little, you know, Trumpy, if you get what I'm saying, a little Cheeto-y, but I think, I think I'm looking pretty good. I think I'm looking pretty blinded. <laughs> okay, since we're already here, let's go in with the next product, the Dragon Beauty Dragon Heart Transformation Face Powder. It comes with two shades, pink opal, which is it transcends with glowy pink pearls to beautifully brighten, and yellow topaz, transform any face fantasy with the light refracting yellow pigments. I think I'm going to go a little bit for the yellow one. Usually does a little bit better for me as in setting factors because I'm a little bit more golden tone. Breathe fire, my dragons. XOXO Nikita. And this is what the palette looks like. Ooh, reflective knee. Holigo. Simply no logical is coming into the chat right now. And this is the powder right her. ASMR. Ah! <laughs> Alright, let's go in as per usual with the Scott Barnes number 64 brush. By the way, guys, if you did not know, you can use code Joshua at scottbarnes.com to get 20% off your order. Ding! Ad plug right there. <laughs> So we're gonna go in with the yellow topaz and I'm gonna go on the under eye. Not too much product comes off. Oh, wow. I'm not too big of a fan of setting under eye powders that are pressed especially, but, whoa. Whoa. That shit took away all my insecurities in my life. What the frick? Wow. Can I see this on the Mark Jacobs mirror? <laughs> oh, wow. Hello. Hello, formula. She said I am here. She said I'm queer. She did not say that. But I'm impressed. I don't have any other press powder to go off of because like I said, I'm not too big of a fan. I've used like more drugstore ones, but this is really, really, really nice. And I love that it comes with two shades. I don't see any like creasing. Uh, I just see brightening. And again, with that purple lavender under and with the concealer and now this face powder, I'm looking very brightened. I want to die. <laughs> this is why I stopped YouTube. No, I'm joking. <laughs> but it's looking mighty fine. Putting away my under eye bags. Why are we having hit after hit after hit? All right. Are you guys ready for the last product from Dragon Beauty? Here we go. We have the face palettes from Nikita herself. She's inboxing here. Let's see. Let's have her come out. <laughs> this is so odd. Nikita. Nikita. <laughs> I'm so stupid. All right, let's open this up. Go on. So in here we have a, I believe if I'm not wrong, we have a contour shade, we have a blush, and we also have a highlight. So boom, 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 boom. We have one of each. And I guess um, we're just gonna go in. Let's start with the contour. I'm gonna go in with the Scott Barnes and number 65 brush and I'm gonna dip into Femme first. I think it's too light for me, but let me check it out. Oh no, yeah, she's there. So this is Femme that I'm dipping into right now. It's a little harsh, but it does blend out very nice. It's very forgiving. Uh, there's a lot of kickback on the pan. I don't know if that matters to any of you, but there is a good amount of kickback. Like, I just tapped in right there, and you can already see there's like a good amount, and I barely touched it. I'm not gonna lie, I do 
I do like how this is looking. It is looking very nice. I'm gonna go in with my good face. So my Scott Barnes number 67. And just buff that out. That's looking very nice. I do like how that's looking. And now let's go into the blush. Excuse me. <laughs> it's hot. <laughs> Let's go into Baby Girl, which is right here under Surge. I'm going to dip in with my Scott Barnes number 64 brush, of course, my bl blush brush. Not too much pigment, but let's see. Oh, I like how that looks. It's very natural. It's very like I'm a little sick and I have a cough. Like it's very eager and I like it. I like how this is looking. And last but not least, let's grab our Scott Barnes. Number 66 brush, our highlighting brush. And let's dip into Fantasy, which is the last shade over here. We're gonna dip into that. And we're just gonna put that all over our orbital bone right here, which is this bone. And when you wanna highlight. Hello. These products are just all coming through. They all said hello. I am loving all these products. Let's go into the nose highlight and we're gonna go in with silicone for my nose. Just gonna go in with my finger. Do you guys see this? I'm impressed. I'm mighty impressed. <laughs> I'm quickly going to do everything on camera that I couldn't do here. So I'm going to do my brows real quick. I'm going to put some mascara on. I'm going to put some lip gloss on. And that's pretty much it. I'll see you in two quick seconds. That's it for this look. Obviously, there's no eyeshadows or anything, but let's go over everything every again. So first up, the two concealers slash color correctors. They were amazing. I told you guys, this one really brightened me up. This one really got rid of the, you know, blue and black hairs and all that type of stuff. And then we have the Dragon Fire Transformation Powder, Dragon Heart Transformation Powder. This was amazing as well. You guys already know this brightened me like crazy. And last but not least, we have the face palette, which was very, very nice as well. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Make sure you guys check out the, the podcast. The link will be in the description down below. And make sure you guys check out the get merch. I'll leave the link in the description down below too. But yeah, catch you guys in the next one. Peace. Don't want you on my mind. Don't want to feel you. Don't want you on my mind. On my mind. On my mind. 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 Mind.